Hey guys! Well, with I feel like we've beaten the dead horse, uh, so to speak, when it comes to WandaVision. Um, although I'm really, really excited to talk about that again on Friday once we get a new episode. Um, and I have Sundance coming up. And we have so much going on that I feel like everything that's been going on, though, we've talked about. So I thought, let's make this an Ask Me Anything within reason, of course, guys. Uh, a live session because you know what? I just don't, I don't have like a full topic. Uh, I was going to try to game today, but I've just been so busy. Hey guys, that, uh, I'm trying to catch up on stuff before Sundance starts. So I figured this was the best way to do it. Uh, Katie, hi, Demet, hello, Elliot. Oh my God. I feel like I haven't talked to you on here in forever. Lauren, hi, Ronnie. What's up? Power 58, Janelle. Nathan, yay, what's up, guys? I, uh, yeah, you know what we can talk about a little bit is wah, wah, Black Widow. Uh, Black Widow not going to Disney+, Plus, which I kind of figured all along. But, you know, it is what it is. Alicia, hi, did notifications work? They must have worked. Uh, did you hear about HBO Max is doing with the release of their movies? Oh, yeah, Scott, that's been old news. Um, I mean, it started with, Basically, they announced it right with Wonder Woman, and uh, I just watched The Little Things, actually. I just watched the screener. My review is coming up later today. It's already on my website. I was just finishing that up. That's why I'm about five minutes late, because I was in the zone typing. And I do need to go back and probably add another paragraph, but I got it up right before this. Mr. Icarus, hello, hello. Katie, you still haven't watched WandaVision? You're missing out. I'm so excited for Friday. So I hope you all join me Friday morning. I'm going to, like, avoid everything. And then, Ted, you're going to really have to help me out in the chat because I'm very nervous <laughs> about how it's going to go. Uh, am I excited for Godzilla vs. Kong? Heck, yes, I am. Oh, my gosh, especially after that trailer and, like, I saw all the action they showed us. It was awesome. Hey, how are you? I'm super excited for the new episode of WandaVision. I can't stop thinking about the show. I'm right there with you, Shadow Links, right there with you. Power 58, my day is good. I'm preparing for Sundance, which starts tonight. The first movie is tonight. So I am... Uh, Trying to catch up on stuff and just, just life is crazy. Hi, David. Uh, I'm trying to just prepare to live in my office for the next six days. It's basically what's going to happen. Uh, so if you see me Friday morning, like, falling asleep during WandaVision, that's why I won't be falling asleep. Don't worry. I will have all the coffee. Ted's here. Hello, Ted. Blair's here. Hi, I'm doing good. Mr. Icarus is doing Amanda Simon. Yes, you should. Uh, who do I have winning the Super Bowl? I'm going to go with the Bucks. You know why I'm gonna go to the box? Because the Tom Brady, my boy. I know, guys, I know. Don't unsubscribe, don't thumbs me down. I grew up in Massachusetts. I've always loved the Patriots, even when they were horrible. And, um, you know, now we've got Brady going to his 10th Super Bowl. I gotta root for my boy, I gotta root for him. Oh, there was no notifications, but. Oh, thanks for the friend request. Of course, Ronnie. Scott says, nice. Elliot, I'm glad the Black Widow isn't going to Disney Plus, in my opinion, for numerous reasons. Elliot, I'm right there with you. And I see people just keep talking about it. And I'm like, no, 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 it's not going to happen. He's not. He's not going. Uh, or it's not. Not he. <laughs> it's not even, listen, it's not going to Disney Plus. I just, I truly think Marvel wants to separate their um, Disney Plus shows from their theatrical releases. And I think that's smart. And that's what they're going to do. The only thing that stinks is I feel like that means everything's going to get pushed if Black Widow gets pushed. But hopefully it doesn't. I mean, we've got a couple of months. Hopefully vaccinations get out there and start working. And uh, we don't have to worry about it, right? Hello, Dave. Who do I think will be the new villain in Wonder Woman 3? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know Wonder Woman enough in the comics. Um, she was never one of... I mean, I was always into Catwoman and... Um, Poison Ivy and Harley. I'm into the Gotham. I was never into the, like, Justice League side of it. So I, I don't know enough to even speculate. Uh, your notifications work, which is why, yay! Good day. I'm doing good. I'm hanging in there. WandaVision episode 4. Can't wait. Yes, I'm excited for Godzilla vs. Kong. Team Godzilla. Yeah, Alicia. I mean, I, listen, I'm totally Team Godzilla. Although I will say Kong looks really amazing in the trailer. Does he not? He looks really good. Uh, what's my YouTube channel name? It's Mama's Geeky. That seems like a silly question. Have you seen the new trailer? Monica is the one in the helicopter most likely. I saw the new little 15 second thing or whatever. Um, yeah, but I've been trying to avoid it because I like to be, I just popped up as an ad actually, which is why I saw it. Um, and I, I try to avoid that stuff. I like to go in totally, you know, 
not knowing stuff. That's why I don't watch all the TV spots and stuff. I feel like it's too much sometimes. It's too much. Uh, hey, TJ. What platform is Black Widow going under? I'm not in the loop. It's, it's not. It's going into theaters. Uh, hey, how are you? I've been with you about two years now. Good to see how you've grown your channel. Thank you. It's Ed, 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 C. I I was going to say Eddie, but it's not. Bobcat, what's up? Demarius, hello, happy Wednesday. And Gronk, yes, Ted, and Gronk. Although Gronk, I'm not, I, I think he's great. I just feel like he's, um, uh, doesn't he feel like a frat boy? <laughs> Fraternity, sorry. Uh, and I just don't, there's something off about him that I just don't like as a human being, but I do like him as, as a football player. That sounds awful, but it's how I feel. Uh, but I love him as a football player. Well, I was happy to see them working together again. Um, Angel, hello. Would I marry Tom Brady? I am happily married. So sorry, Tom Brady. Plus, I'm pretty sure he's happily married. Um, what is better, it chapter one or two? One. Yes, I'm going my boy Brady and Gronk too. Oh no, Elliot, don't get mad at me for what I just said about Gronk. <laughs> but yes, we gotta be excited for them. I'm so far behind already. Why will you be stuck in your office all week? Sundance. It's like I'm watching like between 20 and 30 movies in six days. I'm going to be living in my office and just watching movies and writing and recording. It's going to be insane. But get ready for all the coverage. It's going to be fun. Uh, I bet a lot of people had to live at work. Oh, maybe. I don't know. I think a lot of people just worked from home. Uh, which films were my most anticipated ones? Uh, the Suicide Squad for sure is up there. Um, the Eternals. I've started reading the Eternals comic books and I've got to say the Eternals. Um, is, is definitely on my radar for sure. Uh, Godzilla vs. Kong. I'm excited for Dune. Uh, there's so many. There's so many that I'm excited for. I'm excited to see the rest of Raya and The Last Dragon. If you guys have been around for a little bit, you know I got to see about 30 minutes of footage from this movie, so I'm dying to see the rest of it. It's, it's killing me. Uh, I live in New York, and we New Yorkers... Uh, listen, I live in New York too, Dave Goodrich, but I'm from Massachusetts, so I feel like I get a pass. But I know you don't like Tom Brady. Listen, I don't like the Giants. And I feel like I have good reason because they keep beating the Patriots in the Super Bowl. And it's not fair. I mean, I guess it's fair, but it wasn't fair. The Suicide Squad and Peacemaker is the only content I need this year. I'm so excited for that content, Bobcat. My birthday is Saturday. Another trip around the sun. I know, Ted. Elfster sent me a little message. The thing we signed up for with our um, our uh, uh, gift exchange, members only gift exchange. And it said, Ted's birthday is coming up. I wrote it down. I'm going to text you if I remember, although I will be in full Sundance mode, so who knows? I might forget. If I forget, forgive me. Why is my name Mama's Geeky? Well, I used to be way back when I started. I was like Mama Smith or something, and um, I just decided that I wanted to focus solely on entertainment because that's what I love. So I wanted to focus on, you know, TV shows, uh, movies, video games, comic books, and enter all entertainment uh, and I wanted to keep the mama in the name because they say when you transition, you should always keep the same so that people don't lose you. Like, you know, and then I went with Mama's Geeky. I was actually talking with one of my friends. We were spitballing a bunch of stuff and she came up with that one and I kind of loved it because I am totally geeky. And that was the point. I wanted to focus on geek stuff and entertainment. After Uncharted, oh, I'm so sad that's pushed out. Anyway, uh, what video game would you like to see adapted into a movie? Oh, well, I see they're doing Borderlands, which I'm cautiously optimistic. I'm very nervous about it. I'm very nervous about it. Um, Kate Winslet, I believe, has been cast as Lilith, which I feel like is good. I see Kevin Hart is attached to it. I just, I'm very nervous because that will have to be done perfectly. I love Borderlands, but it will have to be done really well. I would love to see a Mass Effect. Um, that would be interesting. Uh, although I feel like it would be a lot like The Expanse, probably. And when I posted my what if, your notifications would be on so that both you and Amanda would be the first to see it. Uh, Team Godzilla! I got myself a Zack Snyder Justice League and Wonder Woman jumpers coming. Awesome! Ronnie, that's great. That's perfect. What headphones do I use? Listen, I don't have very exciting headphones. I have these ones that like came with my phone, I think, forever ago. That's what I use. If I'm gaming, though, I use Turtle Beach headphones. But I use these for like interviews and stuff. Uh, it's not that exciting. <laughs> it's very boring. Who do I think will play Joker in the new Batman film? Oh, I hate fan casting because I just, I'm so bad at it because I just can never come up with anyone good. I, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. That's a hard one. I'll come back to it, maybe. I can't wait for all the new movies coming to HBO Max here. Oh my gosh, Dave, I'm so excited. I'm so far behind on comments already. How did this happen? 
And on the subject of what if ideas, oh, I'm not going to go down that road right now. Sorry, 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 Mr. Icarus. I just have a lot of stuff I got to prepare for Sundance and I've got all these other questions to at answer. Um, I'm a little bit late. What Marvel Disney show are you most excited for? I think what if. I'm very, very excited for what if. I love the comic series what if. If you guys have seen it, I have videos on here. If you search what if in my on my channel, I was talking about my favorites a while back. So uh, definitely excited for what if, but I'm excited for all of them. Hawkeye 2, eventually. Uh, hi, the entertainment outlet and Curtis Harris. Hello, Olivia. Um, I'm going to have to block you. I'm sorry. Or remove you. I can't. I don't know how to block you. I don't know that I can, but I will put you in timeout because you shouldn't be coming on here saying bad words. Okay? Even if it is anatomically correct. Uh, you can't say it. This is a family channel, sort of. I do swear sometimes, but you can't put words like that. Sorry. Uh, or not sorry. I shouldn't say sorry. Anyway, <laughs> let me continue. Elliot says, I'm going to get a Kindle Fire to start reading some comics digitally. Yeah, so I got the Marvel Unlimited, but it's not the same. But I did get it. The first two, I'm going to read our Vision and the Scarlet Witch, which I just reread. Awesome. Yes, and the Matt Fraction Hawkeye run. Elliot, you're picking some good ones. Where did I get the TARDIS? My husband got it for me. For, I think it was either my birthday or, or our anniversary. Um, so I don't know where he got it. Probably Amazon or something, or I have no clue. I hope Kong and Godzilla both team up to take on a new evil that's pitting them against each other. I think that's exactly what's going to happen, Brian. Gronk and Frat Boy all he wants between the sidelines Gronk and Solid. That's exactly it. You're right, Ted. That's what I said. I love him on the field, but off the field, I'm like, he's kind of a jerk. Mm -hmm. um, you liked it Chapter 1 better, too? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, my God, it's so hard when people have been deleted or timed out to see your comments in between them. So if I miss it, I am so sorry. Alicia is looking forward to the Sundance reviews. Yeah, I think I've decided what I'm going to do is put them all in a like one video and then have like the time codes down below where you can skip to different reviews because it or else it's going to be crazy because I'll be having like four to seven a day, which is too much. Oh, Curtis can't wait till Ryan the Last Dragon with you there. Team Godzilla all the way, says Ronnie. Woo woo. Do I watch anime? I do. I do not as much as I would like to. I just haven't had the time lately to sit down and really watch. Um, to, to sit down and really watch some anime. Uh, I've just been very busy with screeners. It's award season, so I mean, I'm telling you, I get 20 plus screeners a day in my inbox. It's insane, uh, and I have to pick and choose what to what to. Um, watch and ugh, it's nuts but i do love anime and hopefully i have time to sit down and watch it again after award season is over alicia shh no <laughs> co brady uh andrew says geeks andrew what's up giddy license kong rules <gasps> that's a bad word <laughs> i i like them both but i just my gut says godzilla sean says hi hi sean you live in syracuse Dave, I live outside of Syracuse. I'm like 40 minutes away from Syracuse, by the way. Uh, and I don't like any New York team. I can't stand the Pats. I gotta admit, he's the GOAT. Exactly. That's exactly right. Um, what if I'm working on right now? I'll get to that another time. Uh, Ronnie saying hi to Andrew. You just watched Penguin Bloom and it's really good. Oh, I'm glad you liked it because I did not like it. I just thought I found it very boring and slow. And I just was ready for it to be over about half an hour in. I think I would have connected a lot more if it started pre-accident instead of just starting with the accident. I feel like I didn't get to know the the main character and who she was before the accident. She just seemed really whiny and annoying. Um, and that was my opinion. I have my full review up here. I know. I'm sorry, guys. But that's what I felt. I just couldn't, couldn't do it. Um, let's see. Zeke says hi, hi. Tozy says hi, hi. Ezo God says hi, hi. Uh, Team Godzilla, question mark. Team Kong forever. Oh, Elliot, I'm so excited. I think they, I really, truly think they're going to be on the same team, though. I really, truly do. Cinematic Studio says, hey, Tessa, I snuck out for a minute just so I could check in. I think Bill Skarsgård would be a good joker. You're right. He would be a good joker. He would be a really good joker. Okay, I could get behind that. That's a good one. I would love to see that. You know who'd be? He's too old now, though, I think. Um, but William Defoe, because he was such a good Green Goblin, and I feel like they're very similar. 
but I think he's too old to play him now. Um, are you Marvel or DC? I'm both. I can't choose. I don't want to choose. And I, I hate when people try to tell me that I'm definitely Marvel. Like someone the other day on my Godzilla and Kong reaction actually said, look, she's got nothing DC in the background. Well, I, I do. Uh, if you look like tons of, oh, there they are. Tons of these pops uh, are, um, DC. Also, I have a Poison Ivy tattoo. Also, my daughter's name is Ivy after Poison Ivy. So I am definitely a DC fan. Uh, and I hate, I don't think we should have to fight. Why can't you like both? I like both. I love both. Uh, Catwoman's my girl. She's probably my favorite, uh, probably one of my favorite female comic book characters of all time. I own every single comic book of hers. I love Catwoman. And I'm also, Joker's my favorite villain, hands down. Not even a question, my favorite comic book villain. So I hate that question. Are you Marvel or DC? And that's no offense to you, but uh, because I, I don't understand why you can't like both. I, I, I really don't. Uh, Ronnie says he thinks Godzilla and Kong will team up against Mecha Godzilla, and I am with you, Ronnie, because didn't we see Mecha Godzilla at the beginning? Uh, my favorite childhood shows growing up. Oh, I used to love like Power Rangers, and then um, like I watched Seventh Heaven with my family. But even way back then, I used to love like TGIF, like um, Boy Meets World, and all that stuff. Uh, what was that one where they would get slimed? You can't do that on television. That was one of my favorites too. Brian, happy birthday. Oh, Jordan, thank you. I'm glad you like this shirt. I have to change for an interview later because I can't have anything branded on. Uh, I just threw this on after my uh, shower today, after my workout. Andrew says, happy birthday, Brian. Andrew, you're so nice. Is Soul Top 5 Pixar to you? Ah, ooh. I have to watch it again because I watched it a long time ago and I watched it while I was in this mode of having to watch so many things for work. I watched it early November uh, because I got a screener for it and then we had the junket and then it kind of fell off my radar. There's so many good Pixar movies. I I hate ranking stuff because it it always, I feel like it's any given day, it can change. You know, it's more like, what do I want to rewatch today? Because I love Inside Out. That's one of my favorites. Of course, the Toy Stories. Um, I don't know, it's hard to say. It's definitely top 10. It's hard to say if it's top five. Mooch is here. Hola, everybody. Kong Skull Island become a Netflix animated series. That's, oh, I'm so excited. Are you kidding me? I think that's fantastic. I saw that and I'm here for it. I mean, look at uh, Jurassic World, right? Um, the uh, Camp Cretaceous. That's a great show. So I'm definitely excited. Jaden says, hello, hello. Dan is here. I wish I had known the title of this chat ahead of time. Then I could have been more prepared. Dan, it was more, uh, I've got nothing. Let's just do ask me anything and we'll chat about whatever. That's basically what this is. Dan, I have a question for you. I want to know if you've watched WandaVision yet. Um, and if you can join on Friday and watch like live for real, that would be so fun. Andrew with an H. <laughs> My Turtle Beach headphones are way over there, but I have tons of video and I'm not getting up and I'd have to move all my lights, walk around them. I'm not doing that. But I do have videos, any gaming video that I have up here, it has me with them on. So, uh, Matt, hi Matt. All right, the clip of the Suicide Squad we got today made my week. Oh my God. I think the pre-order for the Pops for the Suicide Squad are going to come live Friday. <gasps> no way. Oh my God, that would be amazing. Yeah, so I'll just buy them all. Right. <laughs> Rest in peace, my wallet. I'm right there with you, Bobcat. I'm hanging in there, Matt. Doing good. Preparing for Sundance. Just getting in there. Thank you, Alicia says that's a good idea. That's how far back I am. In regards to the Godzilla vs. Kong trailer, would you like if they played, uh, if they play, I love it when they come. Oh, ha, that's funny. I thought that would be funny. Uh, so in Space Jam 2, LeBron's going to switch teams and join the bad guys against the Legions. Hey, listen, I'm cool with that. Uh, the Flash is on schedule to start filming. I've never watched The Flash. I should, though. Uh, I love me some anime too. I'm currently watching. Oh, okay. My, I think my husband was watching that. You know, he, I think he's watching Attack on Titans now. Um, <laughs> oh my God, I'm reading so fast that I'm going to uh, think there will ever be a Riddick movie starring Vin Diesel. Um, I see him as an anti-hero. Yeah, he is definitely an anti-hero. Wasn't, oh, another Riddick movie. I was like, isn't there already a Riddick movie? <laughs> I was like very confused for a second. Um, I mean, listen, I liked the, those a lot. I'd be, I'd be cool with that. Bye, Andrew. Uh, okay, I was about to ask you if you watch anime, but someone beat me to it. Drop me in, blah, 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 blah. Um, shout out East West. Okay, shout out East West. I don't know what that means, but sure. 
A quick question. Have you heard of Stephen King book Carrie? Yes, and the movie. Read the book, watched the movie. Very good. Really like it. Uh, I'm surprised we even got any clips. Haven't gotten any clips of Matrix 4. I know. Maybe we'll get some new trailers during the Super Bowl. I think for sure we're getting some stuff during the Super Bowl, but I mean, I don't know, but um, that would be awesome. Let's see. Oh my God. I'm so far behind. Uh, Stephen King's Storm of the Century. I love Stephen King's Storm of the Century. That's such a good one, Brian. Are you ready for The Conjuring 3? No, I haven't watched any Conjuring. I, I, I mean, I guess I should. It never interested me, but I, I think I just, it seemed too scary for me, which I love to be scared, but it like terrified me a little bit, but maybe I should get into it. And then I heard mixed reviews from someone. And so I don't know, but maybe I'll check it out. What about Leonardo? Di I just can't even think about adding anything to my plate at the moment. What about Leonardo DiCaprio as Joker? Leo could pull it off. He'd be an interesting take on it. Would make a good, yeah. You know what, Elliot? He's a good choice. He would be very, very interesting. Um, I want Godzuki to return. I don't think I know what that is. If you're under 40, think Scrappy-Doo to Scoob. Oh, okay. <laughs> there you go. If your daughter ever gets the ability to control plants, I will blame that on you. Yes, it will be all my fault. Uh, I see Leo DiCaprio as Mr. Frieza. Okay, I can see that too. Uh, we already talked about the cartoon. My favorite childhood shows. Ah! Just skipped it down. Sorry. I can't wait to... Uh, do I know anything from Brazil? No, I'm waiting for the DCAU to bring Poison Ivy to the universe because she's long overdue and she's one of the most iconic comic book villains of all time. I second that, Elliot. Yes. Oh my God, you can't do all that television. I haven't thought about that show in so long. Yes, they would dump slime on you if you said I didn't know. Yes, it was so fun. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I am finally caught up with WandaVision. So good, so good so far. I cannot wait for this next episode. I think the world is about to turn upside down. And so I am going to be avoiding all social media. I am going to be coming in here and I am even probably going to avoid the chat while I watch it live with you guys. Friday at 9 a.m. Eastern time, which I always do. But I am so worried that people are going to ruin it for me because it will have been out for six hours, which, you know, come on, people don't ruin stuff. Not you guys, but like on, like I can't go on Twitter. I'm not going to be able to go on Facebook. I'm not going to be able to do anything. I'm not even going to open up my phone. I'm just going to sit down and react is what's going to happen. Oh, uh, yes. You're going to watch WandaVision on Friday and we all go in blind for episode four. Oh my gosh. It's going to be crazy, Ronnie. I'm so excited. I'm excited for the next episode of WandaVision. I can't watch WandaVision yet. Um, do you remember what would you do on Nick? What, what would you do? I don't know. I think maybe... Would I dye my hair red? I don't think I could pull off red. I like the purple. Uh, is there any Marvel comic book storylines you recommend? I was thinking of reading House of M and Secret Invasion 2. House of M, Secret Invasion, you got to go right into Dark Reign from Secret Invasion. I promise you, you're going to want to anyway by the time you finish Secret Invasion. Uh, those would be my three biggest ones after the stuff you said you read. And then I've been reading Jack Kirby's The Eternals, which I definitely recommend. Ren Geekness recommended that to me, and I recommend it right back to you. Ah! Oh my God, it just jumped all the way down. Oh my gosh. Oh, my comments just jumped all the way down. I got to go all the way back up. I don't know where I was. Okay, Dan says, I did watch WandaVision. I was on your Monday chat off and on. Not sure if I'll watch it live with you on Fridays. I have to work and I've been watching with my girlfriend. Oh yeah, of course, you're totally allowed. <laughs> I shouldn't be your priority, Dan. Uh, I see William Defoe's dark side, okay. And I think he'd be a good joker. Look, and kind of old though. Look, see, this is how far away we are. Oh my gosh. Still can't believe John Cena got cast as Peacemaker. I, listen, I'm kind of for it. Tessa, did you see Bird Running Water's name in any of your Sundance literature? I did not. Uh, but I haven't been, listen, I have over 100 emails from Sundance that I haven't even dug into yet. I'm waiting until tonight because I just, I had to catch up on stuff. And I still have two things I have to do, have to do before the first movie tonight. So I almost canceled this chat. I was this close, but I thought I got to get in here because I don't know that next Wednesday I'll be in here. But stay tuned for all sorts of content for me. I will see you guys on Friday though, for sure, for Wonder Vision. Um, how are you, how, wait, you know who would be great playing the Joker, the chameleon, Dan. I thought you were going to be serious for a second. How, how ex I mean, I guess you probably are serious, but you know what I mean. How excited are you for the Batman? Oh, sorry. I think Robert could be one of the best Batmans. I agree, Ronnie. I think he could be. I think everyone's in for a surprise. 
You know there's going to be variant pops for the Suicide Squad that are exclusive to specific stores. Oh, I'm going to have all of them. And it's going to be amazing. Are you a comic book collector? And if so, what's your... Oh, yeah, I am. So uh, it, before I moved the TARDIS over, you could see all my comic books back there. I've, I mean, thousands, hundreds of thousands of comics. I've been reading them forever since I was like eight. Um, I don't know. I... I I just, I collect them to read them. I don't, I don't like keep up on like what's worth what or what, you know, one of my favorite ones is probably the first appearance of Gambit. I love that book, but. Um, why is this video on your suggestions? I don't know, but you don't have to watch it. Alicia says, watch party for the Conjuring films. <laughs> That's hilarious. Maybe if I have time, um, I wish I could show you and I can't cause half of the stuff is under embargo. My schedule for the next two months, I literally the next week I'm going to be in here sleeping. Um, basically I'm going to be watching stuff. I mean, some movies start at one, 2 AM. I'm going to look up when the conjuring comes out now because I'm not sure. Then I've got stuff that's all sorts of stuff that's under embargo. Um, that I've got to, it comes out in June. I maybe I'm ugh, I'm not committing to it, but it is possible that I will be able to. I don't know. It is possible, Alicia, but I can't guarantee it. I will try my hardest. Uh, hey, trailer gamer. Hey, Caroline. Uh, I am ah jumped up again. Oh my gosh, you're ready for Mortal Kombat. I am too. Um. No, I don't watch Tech on Titan. My husband does. I want to, though. I'm so, I'm so like, lost on here. What is that? Terrence is here. Congratulations on all your channel growth. Of course. Thank you. I will never forget you. Don't worry. I just watched Fate of the Wings. It's so good, right? Yes. I need, I need a second season. I really, really liked it. Um, I do not think they should put a CGI Chadwick Boseman in the next Black Panther, and I don't think they should recast him. I'm very happy with the fact that they are, they have said they are not going to be doing that. Uh, Paul, hi, Paul. Did you hear that up here? Oh, Terrence. Well, I'm ex yeah, I know. All right. Okay, Caroline. I'm not, I'm not being negative today. I'm not going down that road. Um, let's see. Welcome to Good Burger, home of the Good Burger. Can I take your order? Oh my gosh. I loved that. <laughs> that was all that, right? Is that all that? I think the events in WandaVision's leading up to Avengers Infinity War. Do you, you think so? I don't think so. I th think this is definitely after. I'm going to be avoiding everything because I think Vision is for sure dead. Everything WandaVision drops 7 p.m. Friday night. Now should be waiting for your live. Yay, Alicia, you're the best. Thank you. Uh, Emma Stone for Poison Ivy. All right. Yeah, I could take that. Are you a Ryan Coogler uh, fan? Fruit Ball State? What? Oh, 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 <laughs> I was like, there was no punctuation and I was very confused for a second. I was trying to piece that comment together without punctuation. Um, I love Ryan Coogler, uh, big fan. Uh, 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 I'm so excited for Judas and the Black Messiah. I'm watching that at Sundance. I think it's Saturday night. Uh, oh, good, Paul. It can help me. It can help be my, my Sundance snack. Thank you, Paul. Seriously, that will be my, like, I'm holed up in my office for hours. This is my snack to keep me going. Um, I appreciate that, Paul. Thank you. Uh, Raya will have its own audience. Yeah, uh, yeah, right. Listen, I know. Ted, thank you. Thanks for handling that, Ted. <laughs> How is this going so fast? This is crazy. All right, Elliot says, thoughts on HBO Max developing a Harry Potter series. Here for it, here for it. I hope they're not remaking it. I'm with you. I would love a prequel. That would be fantastic. Yes, I'm Elliot, 100 million percent uh, with you. All right, bye, Terrence. Hey, Sticky Art. Apparently, one division episode is gonna, four is going to focus on sword. It wouldn't surprise me one bit, Reese. I'm, we need to now. I'm so excited. I can't wait. Uh, Sticky Heart says, because it's good content. Thank you. Uh, what are your thoughts on the changes coming to the Jungle Cruise? I mean, I'm fine with it. It doesn't bother me at all. Uh, Chris, hey, how is it there? How are you doing? Ahmed says, loves me from Egypt. Hello. Tessa, shall we do a watch party for the Snyder Cup for whole four hours? I would have, there's no way, <laughs> Ronnie. I'd be like, okay, guys, it's time to go pee. Let's all go take a pee break. <laughs> I guess I have access. I have access. I have, um, 
practice doing that with my children. Oh, what time is the watch along on Friday? Reese, it's 9 a.m. Eastern time. It's always 9 a.m. Eastern time. As much as I want to move it to like 3 a.m. and stay awake, it's 9 a.m. Eastern time. I'm just going to avoid everything. Um, at least I'll be in Sundance mode, so I'll be watching movies. I'm the contrarian on WandaVision so far. I, that's my husband. It's the same way, Dan, but I think things are about to change. Um, let's see. What did, I have a review of Fake the Winx Club Saga up here, Brian, if you want to search for it and get all my thoughts. Um, hi, Sheesh fan from South Africa. I heard a rumor that Henry Cavill could be playing Captain Britain in the MCU. Thoughts? I have not heard that. However, I would not be opposed to it. I think I like Henry Cavill. I think he's extremely talented. And I think he could definitely pull off being Captain Britain. So I'm here for it, actually. I think that's a really good casting. Um, really good casting. I tweeted at HBO <laughs> every time. <laughs> and then it goes, roop. <laughs> And go, <laughs> I'm trying to read all these comments. I tweeted that HBO Max should do a Harry Potter prequel um, of the founders of Hogwarts set. Oh, medieval era, thousand years ago. Yeah, and you did a fan cast on Twitter. Awesome, I'll check it out. Everyone go check it out on Elliot's Twitter. Uh, uh, uh. I've been going through and unfollowing people, not you, obviously, but like uh, that have just clogged my feed with stuff. And I love it because I'm starting to see a lot more stuff I care about, but I must have missed that, Elliot. But I've also been in like, I need so many, there's like so many things I need to do um, before Sundance starts, which is tonight. Ah, Martin, what's up? I just watched Faye as well. I liked it more than I thought, but I'm only there for five characters. I like, do I think Storm should still be in Wakanda? I don't know. I mean, I'd be okay with it if they did it right. Just maybe she's like friends with Shuri or something. Um, love you from Egypt. Good burger movie. I hope they make a third season of One Punch Man. I never watched it. I think... Black Panther should be recast. No! I don't think so. The character should be bigger than the actor that played him. I don't think so for Black Panther. In the comics, Shuri becomes Black Panther anyway. It's the perfect time to do it. Um, the great thing about The Conjuring is that it's bizarrely uplifting. Interesting. I read your comment like a hundred times, Ahmed. Do you keep... I don't know what to tell you. Dan Crane. <laughs> he is crazy. Hey, Drake Red Ring official. I, I've not gotten the chance to pick it up. No, I have it. It's uh, over there somewhere in my bookshelf but uh no absolutely not sorry I've been so busy it's ridiculous I got Sundance coming up with award season I'm getting like I'm not even exaggerating at least 20 screeners a day <laughs> and I obviously can't even watch them all so no <laughs> I haven't there's it's no <laughs> sorry it's probably gonna be a while probably a few months to be honest with you because I'm I'm I have to read The Eternals before the movie comes out. And I just have so much stuff. So no, but I did buy it and I do have it. Uh, how'd you come up with your YouTube name? I touched on that earlier, but really I just, um, I'm a mom and I'm geeky and I wanted to focus on entertainment and it used to be like Mama Smith's and then I moved it and I wanted to keep the mama along and one of my friends suggested it and I went with it. The end. My favorite Harry Potter movie. Ooh. Ooh. I really like Prisoner of Azkaban. I really like Prisoner of Azkaban. I love them all. That's a hard one. Um, how's everyone doing? Or how's everyone's day or night so far? Cameron, I'm good. HBO Max, Marauders. Prequel series, maybe. Can you imagine what Polka Dot Man and Weasel will look like as a pop? Definitely ordering Harley Bloodsport. I'm just going to order everybody. I mean, of course. But yes, Harley's probably one that's going to go fast. Um, are you a high school musical fan? The original? No, never watched it. Never watched it. Maybe bits and pieces because like my kids started watching it when on was on Disney Plus, but I never watched it. Family Guy, I watch if it's on, but I don't like sit and watch it every new episode. Um, but if it's on, I like the other night it came on and we watched a little bit of it, but I'm not like you know. Oh, it's a new episode. I have to watch it. I don't even know if they still have new episodes. Um, let's see. Attack on Titan, you all make that show sound like it's one of the greatest animes out there. The more everybody keeps talking about it, the more I keep kicking myself for not seeing it. So watch it now. I mean, I if I haven't watched it yet, my husband's watched it. Uh, he's got the books as well, and uh, I'll check it out eventually. Still so jealous that you are getting I don't know that I... Oh, that you mean that we're getting it. I was going to say, I thought you meant as a screener, Alicia. I can't believe you guys aren't getting Zack's Justice League. Uh, I'm sure you will. 
Uh, you said there's no date here. There's no date here either, but I think we just know we're getting it. Sorry if I don't chat a whole lot. You're a shy person. Don't worry about it. Now it's because you can tell Wanda if she did create this, created this after Vision died. Exactly. Vision is for real dead. <sighs> a new series in the Battlestar Galactica universe is being planned. I never watched Battlestar Galactica. But maybe I'll have to check it out. Um, let's see. I like Taylor Lautner. Ah! Oh my god, you guys! So far behind! Uh, if he didn't die, it would be different. No, I'm not going to show the book, because I'd have to get up and go find it. And I'm not going to do that. Um, it's either there or over here. I think it's on, I think it's in my, it's over there. It's got to be, I'm not getting up. Sorry. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not going to get up and have my back to the camera while I search, search my bookshelf. Um, and I'm not sure. It's either over there. It might be on this bookshelf that's in front of me. I don't know. I, I'm not, there's no way I'm going to get to it for a while. I can just tell you that right now, just being honest. But I feel like I supported you and bought it, and I will dig into it when I do have the time. I, I'm very, very, very busy. I work about 100 plus hours a week, um, which is insane. <sighs> Um, let's see. I have some casting news for everyone. Luke Evans is playing the coachman. I saw that from Disney's live action Pinocchio. I'm here for it because he's really good as Gaston. So I'm really excited to see him play this role. And I think he's going to, I think he's really, really going to pull it off. Um, I'm very excited. Very excited. Uh, if Storms will kind of have a pretty big hunch. There will be a love triangle. I mean, I don't think so. She's too... Y young um but we'll see we'll see uh let's see two days until the next episode i'm listen chris chris i watched the first three episodes three weeks ago <laughs> three weeks ago this is killing me it's like i'm having to wait so long uh my favorite source is stone least favorite is half-blood prince because it's slow for me i can get that half-blood prince is a little slow uh, I rank the Harry Potter movies the same as I rank all the books. I say High School Musical, Musical, the series is my favorite. I love High School Musical, Musical, the series. That drama that's going on right now is crazy between the actors and then, um, what's her name? Not Sophia Carson. Uh, Sabrina Carpenter? It's nuts. The sitcom mask of, this is exa Dan, you sound exactly like my husband. The sitcom aspect is too gimmicky. And so he said, how come you gotta wait, uh, you know, an hour and a half for it to get good? I love it. But I do see that opinion as well uh 12 chap and hi ted i'm sorry if i don't chat a whole lot okay how did you get those cool tattoos i sat in a tattoo chair <laughs> what are your thoughts of a black panther 2 movie being before everybody was snap backed interesting i'd be here for it whatever happened with your lovecraft country review i never watched it I never watched it because I remember I wanted to wait till it ended to binge it. And now I've just, then the world went crazy and like screeners just started flowing in because people were starting to release things digitally and not have like in-person screeners. And then I haven't watched it. It's on my list to watch eventually, but my list is crazy. Maybe Storm and Cherry will be lovers and then they can get married and divorced and then married. <laughs> Why not? Dan, I'd be cool with that. <laughs> Uh, do you think Black Widow is going to streaming? No, absolutely not. There's no way it's going to streaming. I don't think it is at all. Uh, I think they definitely want to keep their Disney Plus shows separate from their movies at Marvel. I, do, I don't think it will. I'm conflicted on keeping it solely in theaters, but I don't want to wait another year. I don't, I, I truly don't. I mean, I wouldn't be upset, but I don't, I don't think it will. I disliked the High School Musical trilogy. It was boring. I watched the series. I have to say I liked Olivia. Rodrigo's, yes, the driver's license song. Yeah, that's all about Sabrina Carpenter, the, the, the cat fight, and they're all fighting over that one guy. That's crazy. I hope Clint Barton Hawkeye gets his own movie. Me, too. He's the best Avenger. I hope Katana will be in the next one. Brian, should there have never been be another Joker after Heath Ledger died? Oh, Dan's bringing in the facts. But that's different because there's already been a bunch of Jokers. I don't know. Maybe it's not different. I don't know. I still don't want, I don't want him to be recast. I don't. Because it's all in the same universe. I don't like that. 
Uh, Tessa, do you think February will be a bit calmer than this month for you? Probably not, Ronnie. No, because I already have. It booked pretty solid. Uh, there's a lot of junkets, a lot of interviews, um, a lot more stuff. and still technically award season. Um, I don't think things honestly are going to come down for me until probably, and then in March I'm taking vacation. Um, and then we've got Winter's Falcon and Winter Soldier. I don't think things are going to come down to me until this summer. And even then they might not. I think my job, my life is just now I work a hundred plus hours a week and I just deal with it. I think that's my life. That's, that's where I am right now, I guess, because I want to be successful in my career and that's just what I have to do. And that's honestly what I think. Um, let's see. Dan ah, every time people come in. So I need Sisu from Ryan. The last dragon is a plushie. Yes. And I bet you we will get, we will get her. Um, let's see. I feel like I missed a bunch of questions, guys, but I'm sorry. It just shot down and I don't know where I was. Um, I like it for the drama too. Yeah, but no, I'm talking about like the real life drama is crazy right now. Um, it's so, okay. The tattoos are washed. Listen, Ted, I seriously had someone email me once and was like, it's very obvious that you draw your tattoo on before every video and I was like I draw it on, I draw this on before every video because then they said like when I took a picture they said that selfie it was on your other arm and I was thinking it's how selfies work it was like mirrored <laughs> like, what I don't know people are crazy they were like it was on your left arm and then it was on your right arm I'm like you think I take the time to draw a sleeve on my arm every day I love love Simon and I haven't seen wonder I think I have a review of Love, Simon up here if you want to check it out. Um, let's see. I doubt anyone on here has seen the anime Bleach. Nope, I have not. It's a classic Harley. And I need a classic Harley and Joker movie so bad. Oh, Jordan, I would love that. Damn, what have you been drinking better yet? <laughs> oh. How funny do you find it when critics are trying to get a lot of information from Kevin Feige and Facebook and he's playing the roles? Oh my gosh, Elliot, during the... Um, <laughs> During the press event, someone said to him, they go, can you, can you, can you explain, or was it explain or specify? They said, can you specify where phase four ends? And he goes, no, <laughs> like he just looked at him. It was almost like a, what are you, an idiot? Like the way he said, no, it was so funny. <laughs> He's so great. I love him. I love him so much. Am I excited for Chang Chi? Yes, if we forget it. Yes, I am excited for it. Reed Richards and Tony Stark won't meet in the MCU. What do you think? I'm fine with it. Uh, is the book created by a demon many centuries ago can be used in realities? Um, some people believe Wanda could have used that. Hey, Mercedes. Well, thank you for subscribing. Uh, let's see. Have I read the Miles Morales comics? I'm a big Spider-Man fan. I'm looking for some to read. I have. I've, ha I've read some. Um, I have a lot more to read. Uh, but I started reading them on Marvel Unlimited. I'd have to go back and see. I can't tell you what year. I'd have to go into my app and look and go all the way back because I think it shows what you've read, right? But that's, um, but yeah, I bet you would like him, Elliot. My, I, I'm, listen, he's like, I love him so much. Yes, definitely check him out. Uh, I'm hoping that we see Henry as Superman one more time. I wouldn't be opposed to it as long as they deal with the mustache correctly. <laughs> um, do you think the Thunderbolts are coming to the MCU slowly? Oh, I hope so. The Thunderbolts are amazing. Uh, see, the thing is, Dan, the different universe. Oh, you guys are still talking about that. Ah, Alicia says, sending massive hugs. We'll always have my support. You, Alicia knows, because I tell her, like, we'll be talking, and I'm like, I've turned the notifications off, so if I don't talk to you uh, in forever, <laughs> like, you know, that's why uh, I just, I can't. I'm so... I, I'm not overwhelmed, but I'm like, I have quite a bit going on. Not a bad thing, but, um, I mean, I guess it's good to be wanted by studios and to, to be asked my opinion of things. It's just very, very time consuming. Uh, to, and to sit down and read is a luxury. Uh, you guys don't even want to know where I do most of my reading. It's where most people do most of their reading, uh, if I'm being totally honest with you. All right, and good night, Alicia. Let's see. Oh, yeah, I honestly try not to follow it too closely because it makes me feel like I'm getting involved in other people's lives. 
What do we think about Game of Thrones? I think I have a review up here, but I really I love Game of Thrones. I I keep telling myself I want to sit down and watch it all over again from the beginning. Also, um, just when I have time, my dogs' names are Sansa and Khaleesi, so that should tell you right there. Um, have a friend that covered her ink for a wedding. You did? That, well, you know what? They have those, like, sleeves that you can wear that are, like, f fake sleeves, right? Don't they have those for tattoos? Uh, do you hope to see Wolverine, Rogue, and Gambit in WandaVision Season 2? I don't think there'll be a WandaVision Season 2, but I do want to see Rogue and Gambit in the, in the MCU. March 5th is action back because of Riding the Last Dragon, Cherry, Coming to America, um... I probably won't watch Coming to America. I gotta watch the first one still, and the season finale of WandaVision. I know I'm 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 pretty sure I'm gonna get a screener of Ryan the Last Dragon, which I'm excited about, and I know I'm getting a screener for Cherry. It's just a matter of when I get it and when I finish up Sundance coverage, um, and then uh, you know obviously the season finale. They're not giving me ahead of time, so I'll have to check it out. Bye, Cameron. Do you think? Uh, Evan Peters will play Quicksilver. We discuss so we discussed this on my Monday Night Live, and I. Don't know. Just being honest with you. I think he definitely could be, but I can also see him as the bad guy, like Mephisto or someone else. Um, already answered that question about Game of Thrones. Rolando's here. I hope you and your family are doing well. From Bronx, New York, I'm halfway on the series of Game of Thrones on HBO Max. It's really good. I can't wait to finish it. I can't. You're going to have to tell me what you think after. Disturby is the greatest movie with Shia LaBeouf. You know, he was in uh, Pieces of a Woman, and I loved that movie. I was very pleasantly surprised with it. Battlestar Galactica, when you have time, it's pretty good. My girlfriend didn't want to watch it, but now she's really into it. I, I really, truly think I would love it. And that's the problem is because isn't there a lot to watch? So I think that's one that I would start to watch and just be like, ah, I just have so much to go on. Um, and I know I would get sucked into it, you know? Uh, Brian says, Dan, are you saying Black Panther's sister and Storm should be lovers? Why not? So what? Uh, even if the other three ganged up. Oh, you guys are talking about, Okay. So Larley Quinn and Daenerys are my favorite characters of all time. Those are all really, really good characters. Brian, why not? If they're going to kill off... <laughs> Listen, why not? I'm with you. Why not? We could see. Mama's geeky agrees. I do. Why not? I mean, I'm fine. But Listen, I trust Kevin Feige. Whatever he does is going to be brilliant. So if that's what they decide to do, I think, I think you know... Let's not remind her of the nightmares and horrors that mustache. It's so bad, Ronnie. It's so bad. Love watching your reactions, Tessa. This is Alice. Thank you. Can you trust IMDb? No. Anybody can put anything on IMDb. I could go put myself into, um, like, any movie or show that I want to do right now. Uh, easily. <laughs> Very easily. Um, so don't trust. Don't trust it. Uh, do you think Kong's going to win and Godzilla will be defeated? I think they're going to end up teaming up uh, to take down a, a bigger force or something. That's what I think. Uh, Dan says he's only modestly nuts. <laughs> have you seen the posters for Netflix, the series Shadow and Bone yet? Yes, I've seen the posters and pictures, and I have my request in for screeners, which hopefully I get. Tessa, I heard from MCU, is going to give a shot at Black Widow movie and streaming. No, so many people said that, and it's not true. They never said that. Um, I don't think it's going to happen at all. Um, they are still waiting. They have not pushed it. I do not think it is going to go to Disney+. Plus. I would say 99.999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999
I'm making all my friends subscribe to you even if they don't know what your content is. Well, thank you, Ahmed. Uh, Evan Peters is a grown of speed. I gave that prediction and that theory on that on the WandaVision discussion on, on Monday night, Casey, and I think it I mean, he definitely could be. All right, Godzilla. Oh, look, I've been sitting all day. Well, I was on the treadmill this morning, so that is a little bit of a lie, but Godzilla vs. Kong got delayed. Yes, but it didn't really get delayed. If you think about it, it was coming out of May, and they moved it to March, and I think now they've moved it to the end of March. They moved it that one week because I do think we are going to get the Snyder Cut on the 26th. Or 25th or whatever that day is. I did not watch Pixar's uh, Popcorn, but I will. Is it out already? Was it out last week? I Listen, I told you, I can't even... I haven't watched any piece of, like, actual content that's not a screener in, like, two weeks. And it's probably going to be a, quite a while until I can again. Uh, how do screeners work? I'm just curious how tricky screeners are. It, yo, it's so hard. It, you know what helps me is being Rotten Tomatoes. And I know that 100% because I get told that all the time. That, oh, because you're Rotten Tomatoes. Or that's mainly why I get them. I'm, Rotten Tomatoes creates a critics list. So then that goes out to studios. And then they reach out. Yeah, I see you're a Rotten Tomatoes approved critic. Would you be interested in checking this out to uh, review it on Rotten Tomatoes? So uh, I'd say make that your goal, Elliot, for sure. Do you think Harry and Hermione... No. What do you think about Godzilla vs. Kong trailer? If you saw my reaction, you know what I think. Sorry, I'm just trying to get through all these. Heroes became god-awful. I'm with you. It became awful. And it was so good. All right, bye, Drake Red Wing. Uh, favorite character in Game of Thrones? Probably Daenerys. Probably Daenerys. Um, have you ever seen... Hardcore Harry's guys goes through Russia to get his wife back? Nope. Uh, and can be honest. Uh, no Devin, World of Devin. I do not. Don't care to. I'm blocked from her Twitter, so I really don't care. At all about her content. She can do her own thing. Whatever. Uh, what kind of bear is the best? That feels so random. I don't even know. A <laughs> uh, polar bear. I don't know. Panda bear. Do you think Kong versus Godzilla will be similar to Batman versus Superman? You mean that they end up teaming up? Like, they fight a little bit, but then they team up against something else? Yes. Um, I'm not going to get into politics, World of Devon, but, you know, if you've watched my channel or my checked out my Instagram or my Twitter for that fact, uh, you should know. But I'm not getting into it in this one because I have to get going in about five minutes, and I really want to make sure I get to all these questions. I can't wait for Red Notice. Yes, I'm excited. I'm really, really excited for Red Notice. Um Let's see. Which child would I bet? I'm not going to say it, Dan. <laughs> Can't wait for the trailer for Mortal Kombat. I'm right there with you. So to get sources, do you have to be good friends with someone who works in the studios? No. Yeah. You have. You just got to reach out. Just search whatever studio. I'll DM you. This is going to be easier, Elliot. Sorry. I'm just trying to get through all this. Um, DM me so that, like, on Twitter or somewhere so that I remember, and then I'll message you. <sighs> that's too bad. I think it'd be pretty cool if we finally put Spider-Man and Daredevil in the same movie. Oh, there'll be Spider-Man and Daredevil will be in the same movie for sure. Spider-Man and Daredevil are going to be in Spider-Man 3. Um, let's see. For the record, I did not mean to scare you last time when I saw... Oh, uh, <laughs> that was funny. I forgot about that. Uh, I'm excited for Ghostbusters Afterlife, says Ronnie. Me too, me too, me too. Are you going to watch Mother of Dragons? If it ever happens... Maybe. Did you know that the director of WandaVision was asked about... It? Yes, yes, Quicksilver, and she played coy about it. I don't know. Who knows? I mean, I think Quicksilver is coming. It's just a matter of who is playing Quicksilver. All right, Chris, goodbye. Sending love if you need it. Oh, you're so sweet. And even if you don't... <laughs> Yay. Oh, I can be nearly honest again. Oh, thank you so much. I'm starting to lose my voice. Ah, Timothy's here. Uh, know anything about the next episode of WandaVision? No, I don't. So, so listen, they only gave press three three screeners. And uh, so you're going to have to join me at 9 a.m. Eastern time as much as I want to do it earlier. I'm not going to. I'm going to stick to my regular time uh, and watch my reaction. So, yeah, on Friday morning. We have two days, less than two days. Oh, I can't wait. Oh, I just got chills thinking about it. I feel like it's going to be amazing. Inconveniently honest as you are amazing and I love everything you do. Keep up the great work. Oh, you're so sweet. Thank you. Bruno says, hello, hello, hello. Don't get me wrong. I've never seen Game of Thrones. Oh, but someone gave me a spoiler about the, fir the end of the first season. Don't even worry about the end of the first season. Listen, <laughs> there was always this joke. You're talking about 
someone dies. There's this joke that says, why doesn't George R.R. R. Martin have Twitter, who's the writer? And they say, because he killed all 140 characters. Like, this is a known thing of, of uh, Game of Thrones, but it's still fantastic. Yes, Ronnie, I'm interested in Matrix 4 as well. Um, let's see. The whole world went mad and crazy. I mean, I'll be there. Maybe I'll become a content critic if there's anything I can do while it's criticizing. That's true, Dan. I feel like you'd be good at this. Are you going to cover Disney Plus shows like Tiana and Moana? Of course! Oh, Joseph says, hi! How are you? I'm good. How are you? Spider-Man 3 is getting really crowded, and I'm not complaining. It's going to be Avengers-level film. Yes, with all... Uh, the old villains from Sam Raimi's trilogy and Andrew Garfield's film. I'm with you, Elliot, and I think I think it's going to be pulled off really well. I have trust. I'm so excited. I can't wait. Um, I just want a name, and I want a trailer, and they're going to hold off as long as they can, but that's okay. I really, really, truly think uh, that they're going to pull it off. All right, I am wrapping this up, guys. Let me see if I can get through these last few questions. Uh, did you hear the news that Marvel is rebooting The Punisher? But listen, I'm cool with that. I think they should do that with everything. I want Aaron Taylor Johnson. Listen, I would love him too, but I really don't, I truly do not think that it's going to happen. But we shall see. Um, let's see. Timothy says, hello. Oh my gosh, I'm already starting to lose stuff. Let's see. Uh, 9 a.m. Eastern. Yes, Freddy. <laughs> Freddy. Teddy. Ted. Friday. Look, I'm trying to read everything so fast. Ted is saying... <laughs> The Hit Show Mama Vision. See, that means I need to go. Actually, I have an interview in, in two hours. Well, my daughters have an interview. So stay tuned for that. They're going to be interviewing the girl from Gabby, from Gabby's Dollhouse. And they're very excited. And that's going to be on my channel. I'm not even saying nothing in it. It's going to be all them. Uh, thank you, Kingly Ghost. Uh, hope the Punisher beats <laughs> I think so much. <laughs> Good. Uh, I think someone from Sorblood. Yeah, yeah, I know. I think so, too. That's very similar. Um, Andrew Garfield is really, really, I, Tom Holland is definitely my, my favorite Spider-Man because I think he's Spider-Man and Peter Parker. Ronnie's going to go too. Yes. All right. Bye, Ronnie. I got to go too for real. My advice from New Game of Thrones is be careful with the characters you like. You just don't like anybody and you'll be fine. Right, Elliot? That's, that's really good. <laughs> okay. Have I heard of the movie Osmosis Jones? I have not. Next chat. Will you rap for us? I am not rapping. No. I'm not. No, it's never gonna happen. Uh, I'd love to see reaction to Tom Holland lip sync. Oh, I've seen that a billion times, I, a hundred million times. There's no need to have a reaction for it. And I don't normally react to things that are songs because I tend to get copyright strikes, and uh, I don't want a copyright strike because you get three of them and your channel disappears. So I'm very careful about the things I react to now. Also, the same with foreign trailers. That's when I've gotten a copyright strike. It's been for music and it's been for foreign trailers. So from now on, I stay away from that stuff. Uh, Elliot says, bye, bye, Elliot. DM me. I don't want to forget to get back to you. Um, bye. Andrew says, okay. Ah, Timothy. Thank you, Timothy. My birthday's a week away. I'll be 37 years young, and I just want you to wish me well, well, happy and healthy birthday, of course, Timothy. That's awesome. We're the same age. I did not know that. I did not know that. That's awesome. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Ah, as Ted says, remember to hit like and subscribe. Consider becoming a member. It's so much fun. Yeah, as if you join as a member, it's really cool because we do... Um, monthly Zoom meetings, and we have a blast uh, just talking to each other face to face and just going off on tangents like we always do here. It's a lot of fun. Um, all right, guys, I, uh, yeah, I gotta go. But uh, thanks for watching this. As always, stay tuned for more fun and interesting content and blah, 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 blah. And I will see you guys on Wednesday for Mama Vision, aka WandaVision Live, 9 a.m. Eastern Time. I cannot wait. I know this episode is gonna be crazy. Uh, and this is going to be a genuine, true reaction, as I did see the first three episodes. I did not see this one, so I am excited. I've been waiting on it for three weeks. I'm just over the moon. I have videos up about Raya. You can check that out. Aw, oh, Dan, you're 37 at heart. I know it. Just by the way you act. Anyways, love you guys. Mwah. Thanks for taking the time to join me, and uh, I will see you next time.